What's going on you guys? It's Electric Enzo here and my hair is a mess, but we don't talk about it because today we have an insane backyard course set up. So many new obstacles, maybe the most we've ever seen in a backyard course here on my Backyard Ninja Warrior course. It is an insane course, one of the hardest ones I've ever put on as well. It's gonna be crazy. There is some technical stuff. There is some lock-off stuff. There's some crazy balance. It is going to be insane. If you enjoy these videos, make sure to like and subscribe and let's get into the run. Back at it again. The first obstacle is some bar strides, easy to the mat. Then next is a reach to a ring slider. And then from the ring slider, you have to land on the diving board hop straight up to another one, land on another diving board, then hop to a cane and dismount to the grass on the side. That was a really fun obstacle. Never really done anything like that on my course. That was just an average seven foot lache and then a big dismount. I decided to link it because it wasn't too bad. Then next you had to grab the cannonballs, lache to this pole, use the cane to get to the pegs on the doorknobs and uh, go across the doorknob pegs. Pretty simple. Uh, some, sometimes these are really annoying to be accurate on, but I was pretty accurate on them. Get to the last pole and dismount past the green line. Then I sped this up. I didn't really rest, but I don't want to bore you with walking. To get to the slow balance, uh, that thing tipped over really easily. If you stepped on the side at all, it would tip. Then was the teeter-totter, and then straight to the BOSU ball and to the weights. Those weights, if you put any weight on them, they would just tip immediately, so they are kind of hard. Uh, but I got through them. Next was the Iron Maiden all the way up. I just went controlled because I didn't want to go too fast and miss one. So I just was controlled and nice and then did the transfer. I had a little slip up right there, but I was able to fix it. Then moving down the Iron Maiden, uh, one in the last to reach straight over to the Devil Step, Lachey to the Cliffhanger. Cliffhangers all the way down. And then Lachey to the less than one inch Cliffhanger, the yellow one. This one was really thin. Once you catch it, dismount to the concrete. Now coming up is the coolest obstacle in this entire course. And it's not the most amazing angle, so I'm gonna show you from a different angle afterwards as well. But basically, so it starts out with a cane hop. Really cool, I like that shot. Then straight to a bar, and then to these dropping special deliveries called the air mail from Stronghold. Then to these sideways dropping special deliveries called the chain links. Here's a better view of what they look like. So this is me linking the whole line, straight to the air mail, and then the chain links right there. And then here's a slow-mo. So the airmail drops sideways and the chain links do too, but they're sideways as well. Such a cool obstacle. And it was really hard to put in the middle of a course uh, after all that stuff, but I'm really happy that I was able to do it. Ton of fun. Then up three and down three on the salmon ladder and dismount past the line. Now coming near the end of the course, next you had to hop up to the devil step and then lache to the sides of the bunny ears like a sideways hold. And then another sideways straight into the holy trap. Once you go to the holy trap, you have to do a sideways lache to the red cliffhanger and then catch the rodeo rope. And this was really kind of awkward actually because it was a sideways to a forward lache. And yeah, that was awkward. If you didn't catch it right, you the one you would pull one side of the rope down. And then finally I ended with a sky bars move. This is really low to the ground. So it was super hard not to tap my feet on. So that's why I rested a bit just to size it up. But I got the sky bars move and then all I had to do was dismount and I cleared it. And yeah, you guys, I ended up clearing the course. It was a hard one. That last sky bars move was tough, but I ended up clearing the entire course. So if you did enjoy, please make sure to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Let me know if you want to see more course runs down in the comments. I know you guys love them, so just be sure to let me know, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.